Ay, muchachos, tan con Qué rico, Mrs. L. Thank you, Mrs. Bueno. Mm. Uh, uh, mami, it's me. Ah, oh, hello, baby. Hola, mami, ¿cómo estás? Ay, ay. Yo, yo, what's up, man? Ay, what's up, man? Ay, Dios mío, mami, pero ¿qué es esto? You're always taking care of the down and outs. Hey. Yeah, I mean, it's a beautiful thing, but you gotta let them into the house. Aw. Mm -hmm. These are my boys, baby, just like you. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I watch them grow up. Yeah, well, apparently your boys and your real son got some work to do. So, ladies, we gotta roll. Mm -hmm. Come on, let's go. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mrs. L, you're still the best cook mm -hmm. I know. Mwah. Vamos, vamos. Here you go, mommy. Take this, okay? Take care. I gotta go. Take okay? care. You take care, son. Dealing drugs, people getting killed, nightclubs. You take care. Go to school. Be, go somewhere. It's not too late, my baby. I mean, but you got it all wrong. I mean, it's not like that anymore. You know, I, I know good people, I know bad people, you know, but I know the difference. I mean, I know I made mistakes, but things are better now. I mean, how many times we got to go over this? If things are better now, then why are you always like this? Right, but you take the money, right? You take the fucking money every time. Get out of my house. Right. What choice do I have? I lost my job. Yeah, well, call one of your other kids, the one you ain't ashamed of. Come on, bro. I'm coming, I'm coming. We're going out to Bohan, El. Got something coming up to humble for us. Yo, man, you gotta let up on your mom. Oh, yeah, te oigo. But, bro, she rides me too hard, man. Hanging downtown made you forget who you is, El. What you mean? I mean, you a fucking Dominican. All Dominican mamas ride their e-hoes like that. You think me and Rika don't get shit too? <laughs> Damn right. <laughs> Yo, Rika's mama wants his ass to go to college someday. Fool who couldn't even spell SAT, let alone GED. I doubt he could even spell ABC. Only thing I can spell is D V D A. God, your sister taught me that. Ha <laughs> ha. I funny. believe it, bro. She was always a save the world, special needs helping type girl. Special needs to jump on my dick. You boys gonna tell me what's happening here? Yo, we doing some contract work. Getting paid to escort a shipment for some people. That gonna be some unruly shit, bro. We need us another set of eyes. There are gonna be too many people under our purview to cope on our own. And considering your experience as a man manager, we thought you the supervisor at two successful businesses. This is your forte. Let's earn some money. They're bringing the stuff in off that boat. We're going to bring it up here to get in these cars. Then all we got to do is get them back to the heights. Easy peasy. I watch these guys up here. H, L, check the dudes by the river.
Oye, mi pana, this looks like a serious amount of shit coming in. You think we'd be in for some serious time if 5-0 catches with this? Yeah, bro. Or a serious amount of heat if some stick-up guys hear what's going down. Have a look around, they'll make sure things is cool. Inspection underway. That don't sound good, bro. We got trouble up here! Nervous after last time, Luis. And you look about to see we got no the fuck's that? I'm on that shit. I don't like the look of this. We need attack. Don't get distracted, yo. Load that shit up. You better spend that protection money with me now. Check out the boats for anything that seems funky. That don't sound good, bro. 
Thanks for your help, bro. Yeah, I guess my shooting was more important than my man management skills on this business trip. For real? We gonna get paid, bro. Give us a call, okay? Yeah, dude. Let's hang. Smoke inside. Right on! Right on! Well, that. Uh. Listen, yo, I could really use a nice joint right now. Yo, stop screwing with my mind. Hey, Louise, what's up, man? Hey, what's up, Troy? Tony inside? No, he's not here yet. Uh, did you talk to him? Who? Tony, about me. What about you? About me working here, man. I can't do it no more. I ain't queer, and it's doing my head in. Bro, you work for a guy whose nickname since 1985 is Gay Tony. Why do you give a fuck? Because I want to be married, man. You know, I want to have a nice life. I want to pick a fence in Alderney. I want to raise kids, play ball, you know? And look at me. Bro. I don't know what to tell you, man. Desi's the man of Mason, okay? This is the job we got for you. If you don't like it, fuck off, I guess. If you do, shut the fuck up and stop being a moron. Don't be like that, man. You know me. I'm an artist. I've got songs in me. Hello? Maybe if Tony could hear me sing, yeah, thanks. I, 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 I'd yeah, be okay here. It's me. You're the fucking doorman, bro, not the cabaret. What's wrong with you? You're real tense, man. And you used to be cool. Hey, Troy! Hey, how's business? Luis, come on, let's go. Uh, pretty quiet. Oh, fantastic. <laughs> what is wrong with you people? Don't you know a good time when you see one? Jesus! When even the queens don't want to get wrecked, you know this city is turning into a fucking suburb! All right, Luis, get in the car. Gracie, sweetheart, in the back. Tony, can I have a word? No! No. Let's go. Can you take us out to Gracie's house? It's on Babbage Drive. Please. Hey, babe. How are you? Hey, yo, Gracie. What's up? Tone, what the fuck is it with Louise? I mean, he'll try to bang anything with a pussy, but it's Mr. Limp Dick when I'm around. I don't know. Maybe it's your charming turn of phrase, or your demure, almost nun-like manner. What is up with that, Luis? Sorry, Gracie. You ain't my type. So can you let me be a limp dick in peace? Having a pussy is your type, Lou. 
Tell me what's wrong with me. There ain't nothing wrong with you. If you like really loud we that. Please, fuck you. Hey, look. I stopped dealing with monster brats after Danny Lucasella tried to get her daddy to cut my balls off. Call me an asshole. But that was it for me. I know where you're coming from. The shit I got into after my night of indiscretion with Roy Zito. Oh, trying to claim I spiked his drink. Roy Z's a homo? He ain't a very good one. I never would have guessed it. Yeah, well, they don't wear a label on their head. Oh, look at this bitch behind the wheel. Tony, your extreme queeniness is starting to rub off on the employees. Look, Gordon, oh, what are we doing out of Gracie's house? We're paying a visit. Shit, don't we got other problems right now? Come on. Now that you mention it, there is another issue. That fucking Nevish, the Celebinator. Oh my god, I just love that guy's blog. Well, that guy's blog don't love us. What happened? He's talking shit like it's going out of fashion. So what? He thinks he's the only guy with a mouth on the fucking internet? This is something we don't need right now. Oh, no one comes to our summer party in the Caraways. Chill out, bro. First of all, the summer's a long way off. And second, we shouldn't be having no party in the Caraways with our financial situation. This guy could sink us. Listen to him, Lou. The Celebinator is real influential. Relax, bro. We'll send them a basket. It'll be cool. Thanks, Luis. Call me when you've emailed that dreadful blogger. You want more, Mr. Blogger? It's on. does that guy think he is? What? You seen the picture you and me that motherfucker put up there? Yo, that asshole's gotta be taken care of. You're meant to be the rational one here, Luis. Look, I'll see what I can do about it. I'll be in touch. Conflict resolution in here, pal.
Hey, mommy. Luis, I saw that nice man, Mr. Santo, again. Nice man? I mean, he's a loan shark. You didn't borrow no money, did you? No, he helped me with my shopping. He is a real gentleman. You could learn so much from him. Stay away from him, mommy. Listen to me on this. Death metal. Stay safe. Stay Second Amendment. Take that. Thanks. Thank you so much. I hope you enjoy it. I will pursue all the fun. I'm moving in.
professional hey where you going man a couple of years back also a grand yeah man chess. going to wow you American got novel, it and now he's about to solve Here we are, man. And left the line. <clears throat> hey, Lou, come on in. Hang on one second. Check mate. See ya! <laughs> Little thicko never went to college. I never got into an Ivy League school. I got into two! Yeah! <laughs> Come on, let's get out of here. Get us to the heliport near Fish Market South. So, I got a proposition for you, Louie. It's Luis, bro. It'll be little Louise if I want it to be. You still owe me money, so you're still my bitch. Man, Tony, you owe me, bro. You can be hang out with this jackass. Now listen to me. I got a wager. I ain't having no monster measuring contest, bro. I keep telling you I ain't into that creepy shit. No! My jackhammer would crush the shit out of you, bitch! No, 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 no. I'm talking a fair bet. Calculated risk. What's on the line, then? You terrifyingly insecure midget? Well, how about everything Tony owes me? And I promise to get out of your life if you win. Yeah, that sounds too good to be true, bro. What happens if I lose? I get everything. You're rolling with me full time, hombre. Buddies for life. All or nothing, eh? Heavenly peace? For a lifetime of being tortured by some hellish imp. Shit is tough. Calculated risk. What are you gonna do? Okay, so what are we betting on? It's a race, you fucking pussy. All around the city, only for serious high roller cats. Choppers, boats, cars, and, and everything in between. So all I gotta do is win that, and you out of our lives? In theory, yes. But that ain't gonna happen, dog. Because I never lost a nothing in my whole life. Maybe that's because I had a brother as pathetic as Little B. Or maybe it is because I am the S-H-I-T, bitch. Yeah, you shit, all right. Now, if you do win, which you won't, you just gotta help me with one more thing, and then all your contractual obligations are released. Yeah, here's to that. You are rubbing me the wrong way here. Get your ass handed to you, you bitch! Hey, we gonna give a head start to those on the four feet? You have all been provided! Parachutes, boats, and cars! You will be airlifted to the start where you will race from one vehicle to the next. The first person to make it to the finish in Middle Park is the winner. Are you ready? Fuck yeah! Hey, I'm racing an orange midget. Why wouldn't I be ready? <laughs> 